would have thought that this was behind Reno? It's like a giant reservoir. Crazy. Pretty awesome. I had to uh, come down to Reno to like do some errands. And so, decided to bring the Lawrence Major, give it another go, give it another ride. It's been a little bit because um, I had a flat tire. You know what I did? I grabbed some um, tire sealant from for a bicycle, put it into the tube, pumped it up, sealed like a charm. No problem. Well, one surprise, back road through the mountain pass, kind of right behind me, to this nice bike path. I wonder if this thing goes all the way around Reno. Um, one cool thing is when you have no agenda and you're on an electric skateboard is you just go out, I guess it's four, ride, kind of just work on your skills on the board. Kind of what I'm, I have to get back to kind of get in the feel for the Lawrence, just the power it's got, the agility, I mean like the carving is just like next level really. Especially with these three track wheels, it's crazy. It feels just like a snowboard, which exactly what I wanted from an electric skateboard. Yeah. Well, about 15 miles into this ride. The views in Reno right now are just incredible. It's so amazing. Just like the mountains around here, the everything's so gold. It's just incredible. So I'm just going through the same little mountain pass I did before. Uh, getting back in the downtown, you know, proper. Uh, right now, about 24 miles. Five bars on the uh, remote. I've gone through three of them. <laughs> this thing just keeps going, 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 going. Granted, mostly flat today. So I definitely don't get this kind of range in Tahoe because I'm just kind of like going up and down so much. But um, my legs are tired and I'm kind of a dummy and I didn't um, tighten up the trucks like the guy from Lawrence said I should. I just kind of wanted to see if I could handle the um, really sharp carving ability, which it's fun, but there's like a lot of untapped potential that I'm not able to get right now, I don't think. Because they ship these boards with the truck so loose. Which is good for maybe working on your skills on the board, but probably not for actually like utilizing a lot of the power of the board. Then again, according to this, I have half a battery left. Crazy. Just one little descent back down. The sign just said no bicycles and no walking. But it didn't say anything about like skateboards, so I guess I'm fine. It's so short. Anyways, um, almost back. I think I hit like 28 miles. And I still have, according to the board, like part in the middle of it, I still have half of the battery power, 
and it's too cold right now. It is probably 46 degrees. I am literally right now wearing all my ski gear and I'm cold. So this battery is really impressive to go so far when it's just freezing as cold out. So we are getting closer to running this battery down. This has turned out to be quite the morning event. Remote says one, bo one bar left, but the board says I've got like three little dots on it. So I got a bit more, I think. I'm about 30 miles now into this ride today. I'm pretty tired. Like my back is even starting to feel a little bit. So this board is definitely outlasting me. So behind me are some fields. And that is the Reno airport behind me over there. I um, took a road that went behind that mountain, kind of in there, back to the mountains way back there, and then way over there, and then back over here, and then back over those mountains, and then um, way to the other side of the airport, and then back to here. And I'll tell you what, this board has defeated me. I'm on my way back. I think I may have another mile. It's gonna be like 32 miles. Um, and it's cold. So there's that. All right, Lawrence, you win. Just getting back to the starting spot, 33 miles. Um, that was probably a couple hours at least on this board. Man, I love riding this Lux Street boards, but this was kind of a bit much. Call so. it a day good. It's nice to explore some of Reno, which I haven't done really ever. So thanks for watching and we'll catch you on the next one. The thing is, I still got two of those bars. This is ridiculous.